so? What happened to all the people who lived here? Follow the clues, boy. Right, right. Follow the clues. Okay, so there was an evil dwarf king, and he made all these people hunt monsters. The people put them in cages, and then... And then I don't know. Hmm. Well, I'm missing a clue. Back inside the castle? No. There is nothing more for us inside. But stay up. Alert for chain dragons away. Perhaps you'll uncover more about this dwarf king. I know I've been up in a mountain for a while now, no! but since when do the dead not stay dead? No! A little resurrection among friends is one thing, I can hardly complain. But it's as if hell itself is shambling into Midgard. Freya said the world is out of balance. That's how he meddles with forces. Well, that's plain to see. And Odin is the king of meddlers. And I should sure think what he did to cause this. But perhaps it involves the Valkyries. That would be playing a dangerous game indeed. Time for a favor? The other three. And don't be letting that spit pister of a brother of mine lay hands on it again. Always a pleasure. Now fuck right along. Rob Frey of a warrior spirit? Aye. In a world this belligerent, what choice does she have but isolation? Poor Freya. I guess if I was her, I'd spit in your face too. I lied. So would I. This chisel we seek, what is it? I'm glad you asked, actually. I have just the story for you. <laughs> there was a giant once named Thamur. A very giant giant. 
who, despite his mountainous size, was without question the greatest stonemason this world had ever seen. Proud Thamur hoped to one day pass his vast knowledge onto his son, but young Harimthur had the heart of a warrior. Perhaps the father had too much fear in him, or the son too little. Either way, a quarrel of theirs spiraled out of control, and the overworked stonemason, bonk, struck his son. Harimthur ran off into the night. Feeling shame and regret, Thamur chased after his son. But in his emotional state, soon found himself wandering Midgard, lost and alone. Sadly, he caught the eye of the one person he didn't want to meet alone that night. So far from home. Thor. And? What happened next? You'll see. Thor killed him. Oh no. He fell in the village? Aye. When Thamur fell, he crushed a charming place famed for worshipping the Vanir god Njord. Thor always took credit for planning that one. The truth is, the sweaty ball bag just got lucky. A wolver! A dangerous beast. We will take him down together. <laughs> Giant chisel. That big crystal on the giant's ring looks promising. 